in this video i am going to show you how you can give real time information to client which is really helpful especially when you are coding or when you are doing some task with client for example i have the latest gemini pro connected using like the free account i already have a video on how you can get 300 dollar worth of free credit i will show you even with this latest model if you ask what's the latest version of python so as you can see it's offering me like the direct url to the python website and if i just click on run it will open that link directly in the browser so it is not having real-time information of what's happening which is really helpful if we want bug fixing or ask about documentation or like some version mismatch it's always good to have that information readily available in your client right away right to speed up the process so that's why it's important to add this real-time information that too we can add it for free and yeah we can use something called as rave with the help of mcp and you don't need to know any coding in order to actually use use this feature to enhance your experience i'll show you how you can do that all you have to do is uh, once you have installed client and just uh, click here on the mcp server button search for brave see it's been used by a lot of people that's why they got this many stars all you have to do is click on install make sure before trying this you are using the gemini 2.5 pro model because it's a reasoning model and it's really intelligent and it will help you like install this in a matter of like seconds uh, i'm gonna show you like how you can do that see it's other uh, it's already prompting you the steps right so it's asking you to actually sign up for a brave search api account if you already don't have it i don't have the api key created so we can just click on the browser here and as you can see it will give you like 2000 free queries this is uh, not one time this is monthly so that's what's interesting here and you can use it a lot if you are actually running really small queries and let me just log in and once you are here what you can do is they'll send you a, a code uh, to your mail just copy the code to verify your email and just click on submit as you can see to try the api on a free plan you still need to subscribe you won't be charged once you subscribe you can get an api key in the api key section so we'll have to use the subscription just click on the subscribe button here and let's say i have read and understand the terms of use just click on subscribe button and it will send a code it will send a code so as you can see now i am subscribed but i did not get any charge now what you can do is go to your api key then just click on let's add a name like client subscription is free click on add and now we have a token just copy that and it says one request per second so 2000 request per month okay uh, now what you can do is come here and just provide the api key here now it's going to our clients mcp settings and adding that settings now as you can see if i go to my uh, i need to finish for this okay now we are show, seeing this message mcp server updated so if i just click on uh, here i can see we have like an error here so we will just need to copy this error and again come back and paste it before we can do the search if we have any error it will not work so just copy that whatever the error and paste it here so that google can understand how to fix this i don't want to use docker just click make sure node.js is installed i think node is required for this otherwise av will show you so if it's asking for docker say like you just need to use using node so i think now the mcp servers got again updated let's see if it fixed the issue or not now as you can see all our issues are resolved and it seems like it's working and if you don't want 
to always approve you can just click on auto approve that means you don't have to manually approve every time instead of that i just want to know what's the latest uh, python version So uh, the latest Python version is uh, 3.13. So let's see if that's correct. So it's using like uh, Reddit uh, Python website. As you can see, it's 3.13. Is there any cost? Then we can just go to the dashboard and see I have just a usage like one this month so i uh, just want to let you guys know that's how you actually use real-time search with client and that will enhance your experience with client i hope this information was helpful if you liked it please don't forget to share and subscribe for more future videos again thank you for watching have a great day Life.